and I'm back. I know, don't start with and, but I, I am back. Um, last week, while well, I was actually here, um, I was in Hereford. Oh, by the way, Saturday wrap. Saturday wrap for the 2nd of March 2024. Looking back at the past week of me, well, mainly drinking beers and complaining about the weather and then drinking more beers. But anyway, you left me last week just about to go to Hereford, which I did. Um, orange tree. And they had the cobs, they call them. I call them filled rolls. Um, they were ready and waiting. And some really nice, attractive cascales. And then checked into the travel lodge and then over to the beer in hand, which despite the lack of Wi-Fi, if you sit near the door, you get fairly good signal and excellent beers. Right. OK, so um, back to this week. Saturday wrap for Saturday, the 2nd of March, 2024. Meteorological spring. Well, that was yesterday, but today in reality. So let us start with the word or phrase of the week, and it is spring. You have to be careful because the other spring is the equinox. And I think, well, in spring, that's a better spring because the end of February, the beginning of March is well known for snow. Although there is a snow warning for mid Wales and North Wales and there was supposed to be snow last night in Ebervale and Abertillery, but I think it was more like sleet. Beware the Ides of March. Spring. Anyway, the app of the week. OK, so this is one that I use on iPad OS. Uh, the bigger screens help. And it's a web browser, obviously. At the moment, it's got WebKit underneath it, but it's brave. So you don't get any of that bad crypto stuff because Apple won't allow that. But it does block a lot of adverts. And I like it. It's easy to use. It's fast. It's reliable and it's updated a lot. So if you're looking for a web browser that you don't have to worry about and it gets rid of all the junk, Brave on iPad OS. It's also on iOS, but I don't use it there uh, for reasons. Anyway, um, the thing of the week. The thing of the week was in Barcelona. Mobile World Congress. OK, so this is your basic Android World Congress and Android-like World Congress. Basically, because Apple don't go there, so there's not a lot of Apple stuff there. Um, not a great deal of feedback on it. Lots of new phones, but the big thing is the mall is AI and folding. Folding from last year, AI also from last year, and even more so this year. Yeah, and that was about it, really. It wasn't. I don't want to say it wasn't that good, but nothing jumped out. There was nothing earth shattering from it. Anyway, uh, the song of the week. So looking back from the uh, downloaded library that I have on my iPhone and playing some of the tracks and from Andy Roachford, Cuddly Toy. You know, fairly rocky, but a little bit, you know, I liked it a lot. Anyway, um, it's a single. I think it got to... He says, checking Wikipedia, 61 in the UK charts, which is a shame because it really is an excellent track. So, OK, on with the week. Last Saturday, MB03. Yeah. Um, uh, Costa Coffee after the Travel Lodge. It was a frosty start. Um, and then the King's Fee, which filled up. And then emptied out, then filled up, and then emptied out. Um, only had two pints in there, which was just as well, because over to the Hereford Beer House, where they had piles of new merch, which I overbought on. Um, and Cloudwater Ales. They was their ninth birthday. And the DIPA and the Pale Ales, wonderful. I really need to go back more to the Hereford Beer House. And starting off later, especially because I ended up in the beer in hand, was great. Really good. OK, other things that happened on Saturday. Um, I think I, yeah, I boosted, was it No Agenda? 
I can't remember what it was, but someone sort of liked my boost and gave me 21 sats, which I find hilarious. Oh, by the way, at the moment, uh, $61,000 to the Bitcoin. Yeah, there you go. Um, Sunday, returned home. Um, watched all the traffic on the M4 trying to get out of Wales, having to crawl off and then crawl back on because of bridge work. Um, and I took a chance with the weather, put the washing out on the line, managed to gain an extra hour and then it hammered down. Luckily got the washing in first. I don't want to sound washing-like, but, you know, this weather's rubbish for it. It really is rubbish for it. Monday, back into the office. I've only been away for a week, but it was really light in the morning and it was really light in the night and, yeah, well, spring. But all of a sudden things happen. Right, Tuesday and Thursday. Ordered some Roundup. Roundup arrived on the Wednesday, Thursday. The only thing that's really growing well, apart from the lawn and the moss on the lawn, is weeds. So, killing the weeds. Yeah, there you go. Um, Wednesday, I had an email from Tesco, the Android phone a SIM provider, saying, we're going to put your price up uh, unless you do a club card deal. And so I signed up for another two years at a pound cheaper. Pound a month, that is not for the two years. Uh, which was just as well. Because, yeah, times are hard. Friday, St. David's Day. Alon Lan from Purple Moose. And a Welsh cake in the office. And they cancelled the yellow warning of rain. I like that. Anyway, overrun again. Um... Comments where you want comments and bye-bye. I can't find the bye-bye button. Here it is.